it's just really beyond words. You, you have so much mixed emotion in something like this because you know in your heart that it's these people are, are, are given another chance at life and they're going to go on and do wonderful, beautiful things. But at the same time, your heart's breaking in half because you've lost your baby. It makes me feel good because it make, just reminds me that Paige is still here. She's still here, and she's so spirited, and I know some of those things come out are going to come out even more. And after knowing her for an hour or however long you've been here, I already feel like there's a big part of Paige that I can see in her and smile. And Talk to and hear about her day and what she's doing, and it'll still feel like Paige is here. seemed like to, to you guys it was one bad thing after another after another after another versus having the boredom of just being a regular person. Yeah. I'm happy too that that you guys are close enough to us that, that we can come see you. I mean it's not like you're you know on the other side of the world someplace and Well, we weren't sure how you feel about us yeah. either. <laughs> we were afraid to change your address. After you <laughs> As you see, we came and <laughs> with a, yeah, uh, we, our, we our came. Been from the <laughs> we came with a big army today. <laughs> I heard Taylor and her mom say that they didn't feel like they were adequate. Well, we don't feel like we're adequate. You know, it's it's a back and forth thing, and wondering what the other one's feeling, and uh, trying to guess what the other one's. It's just it's just it's. It's an uh, experience you won't forget, an experience that uh, you just can't describe. And I'm guessing everyone may be different. I don't know, but that's how ours has been. Well, I will say this too. One thing that she, her mom mentioned, you know, that she lost her dad because, why? because he was on the list and didn't get a chance to get a kitten. Is that what he's on the list for, right? And it's really a shame that there's only about 40% of men are on one or reporting them. And it's about 65%, I think, of women. But it's just a shame that so many people have to experience what you guys went through. And Taylor has to grow up without her father because not enough people do this. I mean, what a, I mean, I wish, I wish we'd never met them. I mean, I really do. But I can't change that. But we can be thankful that people who appreciate what Paige can be through. You know, I think that's, that's important. You know, and the other fellow that, that got her with him, you know, he was, he was concerned that he, that whether we thought he was good enough to receive him. You know, and, you know, I, we never even actually thought about that part, if anybody was good enough. We just knew that we had to do it. Two, for, you know, we just couldn't be. I mean, if you were going to pick out two people that really appreciate what they've received and the difference it's going to make in their life, I mean, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's kind of like getting a, a little older blonde haired page. <laughs> yeah, and that's uh, so we, you know, you talk about the whole grip print thing, uh, you know. 
this whole thing would be very easy to do just to lay on the couch and cry all the time. And, but we, that's why we wanted to be active with that so that, you know, that we could make Paige's misfortune into other people that they could be aware of how that they, they could 